Ever wonder why stress seems to be an ever-present shadow in our lives? It's because we live in an era of constant change and challenges, which can feel overwhelming. Stress, however, isn't an invincible enemy. It's a force we can learn to manage effectively. Understanding how to relieve stress isn't just about survival, it's about thriving in our modern world. The good news is, there are ways to master the art of calming the mind, and we're about to dive into them. First, let's understand what stress really is. Stress, in essence, is the body's response to any kind of demand or threat. It's a survival mechanism that triggers your fight-or-flight response, preparing you to either face danger head-on or flee from it. Now, not all stress is bad. There's good stress, also known as eustress, which can motivate us and help us perform under pressure. However, when stress becomes chronic, when it's continuous and beyond our control, that's when it starts to wreak havoc on our physical and mental health. Chronic stress can lead to a myriad of health issues, including heart disease, sleep problems, and depression. It can cloud our thinking, make us irritable, and negatively impact our relationships and productivity. Stress is a part and parcel of life, but it's how we manage it that makes all the difference. Now that we have a better understanding of stress, let's explore some techniques to combat it. One of the most effective ways to relieve stress is through mindfulness and meditation. Let's delve into the world of mindfulness first. It's a state of being where you focus your awareness on the present moment while calmly acknowledging and accepting your feelings, thoughts, and bodily sensations. By doing this, you're not ignoring your stress, but rather you're observing it without judgment. This can often lead to a sense of peace and calm. So how does mindfulness work to relieve stress? When you bring your attention to the present moment, you're redirecting your mind away from future concerns or past regrets, two major sources of stress. This helps to reduce the intensity of your stress response and over time can help to reshape your brain's neural pathways, making it easier to respond to stress in healthier ways. Now, let's shift our focus to meditation. This ancient practice is a deep state of peace achieved by focusing the mind on a particular object, thought, or activity. It encourages concentration, clarity, emotional positivity, and a calm view of the true nature of things. Meditation works to relieve stress by giving your mind a break from the hustle and bustle of everyday life. It allows you to recharge and rejuvenate, leading to a greater resilience to stress. It's like giving your mind a mini vacation. Now, here are some tips for beginners. Start small. Even just a few minutes of mindfulness or meditation a day can make a difference. Find a quiet, comfortable place where you won't be disturbed. Concentrate on your breath, the sensations in your body, or a simple mantra to help focus your mind. And most importantly, be patient with yourself. It's perfectly normal for your mind to wander. When it does, just gently bring your focus back without judgment. So, give mindfulness and meditation a try. You might be surprised at the sense of calm and relaxation you can achieve. And don't forget, this is just the beginning. There are many other techniques out there to help you manage stress. Remember, practice makes perfect, so don't be discouraged if it seems challenging at first. Physical activity and a balanced diet can also play a significant role in managing stress. Now let's delve deeper into this fascinating correlation. Exercise is a natural stress reliever as it prompts the body to produce endorphins, the so-called feel-good hormones. Not only does it help in boosting your mood, but also promotes better sleep, which in itself can be a significant factor in reducing stress levels. You don't need to run a marathon or lift heavy weights to reap these benefits. Simple activities like a brisk walk in the park, a quick yoga session, or even dancing to your favorite tunes can do wonders. Now let's turn our attention to the dietary aspect. The food we consume can significantly impact our emotional well-being. For instance, consuming a diet rich in vegetables, fruits, lean protein, and whole grains can help regulate our mood and energy levels. Foods rich in omega-3 fatty acids, like salmon and flax seeds, are known to reduce symptoms of stress and anxiety. On the other hand, caffeine, sugar, and processed foods can cause energy spikes and crashes, leading to increased feelings of stress and anxiety. So it's essential to limit these and focus on incorporating healthier options. But let's not forget the importance of hydration. Dehydration can lead to fatigue, 
headaches, and even feelings of anxiety. So, ensure to drink plenty of water throughout the day. Moreover, establishing a consistent eating schedule can also help manage stress. Eating at regular intervals ensures a steady flow of nutrients, keeping your energy levels stable and preventing mood swings. Remember, it's not about undergoing a complete diet overhaul or signing up for a high-intensity workout regime overnight. It's about making small, manageable changes to your lifestyle. Maybe start by adding more vegetables to your meals or taking a short walk every day. In essence, the key to stress management lies in maintaining a balance. A balance between work and relaxation, sleep and wakefulness, and most importantly, a balance in our diet and physical activities. Remember, it's not about drastic changes, but consistent small steps that lead to a healthier, stress-free life. Sometimes, the best stress relief comes from simply changing your perspective. Today, we delve into cognitive techniques for stress relief where the power of the mind takes center stage. One of the most potent techniques is reframing negative thoughts. This is where you take a pessimistic view of a situation and turn it into an optimistic one. It's about seeing the glass half full rather than half empty. For instance, let's say you're stuck in traffic and your mind starts to spiral into frustration. Instead of succumbing to the negativity, you could reframe your thoughts. You could view this as an opportunity to listen to a podcast you've been meaning to catch up on or simply a chance to breathe and be present in the moment. Practicing gratitude is another cognitive technique that can help alleviate stress. It's about focusing on the positive aspects of your life, the things that you're thankful for. It could be as simple as appreciating the food on your table, the roof over your head, or the people who love and support you. To make gratitude a daily practice, consider keeping a gratitude journal. Every day, jot down three things you're thankful for. They don't have to be monumental. Sometimes, it's the little things that bring the most joy. Another technique is mindfulness. This is about being fully present in the moment, not worrying about the past or the future. It's about accepting things as they are, without judgment. You can practice mindfulness through meditation or simply by focusing on your breathing. Lastly, let's talk about visualization. This is where you imagine a peaceful place or situation to help calm your mind. It could be a serene beach, a quiet forest, or a cozy fireplace. The key is to engage all your senses in this imaginary scenario making it as vivid as possible. In the end, remember that these cognitive techniques are not a one-size-fits-all solution. They require practice and patience. Don't be too hard on yourself if you stumble along the way. Changing your mindset can be a powerful tool in your stress relief arsenal. Mastering the art of calming the mind is a journey, not a destination. We've explored an array of techniques together, each one a stepping stone on the path to tranquility. From mindful breathing to cognitive reframing, each tool is a potent weapon in your arsenal against stress. But remember, this exploration need not end here. An exceptional resource awaits you, the audiobook Stop Overthinking, 23 Techniques to Relieve Stress, Stop Negative Spirals, Declutter Your Mind, and Focus on the Present, The Path to Calm by Nick Trenton. It's a comprehensive guide that dives deeper into the methods we've discussed and introduces new ones, equipping you with a robust repertoire of stress-busting strategies. So why wait? Embrace the journey towards a calmer, more serene self, one technique at a time. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insights and check out the audiobook link in the description. Here's to a calmer, stress-free life.